We have found him. Here we go. Semi-finals game two. Second to last game of the draft. <sighs> this is not the team I had when I fought James earlier. Of course, this isn't the team he had when he fought me. It might be, though. That would suck if it does, but... Did <laughs> I say I don't want to pick the rules? No, James, you get to pick the rules. Alright, series 10. Cool. Here is the final six we will be playing with. And yeah, we're just gonna offer our new up. Good luck to you, James. What do you got? What are you scheming? What'd you bring? Yep, yep, more or less what I expect. I do have. I do have steels. <gasps> Elio is here. I keep forgetting Elio's in this room with me. You have to give it to me. I can't, I, it, I can't reach him. Hi, Elio. I can hear you. Okay, what are we gonna do? Uh, he wants to ditto my legendary. I don't even know if Thunderous gets to come out this match. Uh, yeah, I don't think Thunderous is getting to do anything this time around. Um, I see a lot of special on his side. There's a single Intimidate, the Intimidate, a lot of ice, so that's a threat against Grandpa. Put a lot of ice, so Hitmontop could put in some work. Mammo Swine is pretty much going to have to be guaranteed, because he's got the coverage to deal with the ice. So what does that leave for the last spot? I have a better idea. I, I hope it's a better idea. I really don't like bringing Thunderous to this fight. So let's not. Let's just not bring Thunderous, and things will be fine. Or a cat clipping. Hmm. We're probably gonna regret not having Thunderous because we want to get a taunt on that Clefable ASAP. And we don't have taunts. Um, but if you can't do damage, then life is good. So, let's start with some screens, and swap into Hitmonta. I suspect he's going to try and fake out Musharna, because uh, this this setup reads Trick Room. Screams Trick Room. And I'm kind of leaving on Trick Room pretty heavy this time around. <laughs> I don't think anything has any speed investment in my team right now. We could fake out the fable, but we'll probably whiff it because that's how luck is. He got two boosts to his evasion already, and now I'm not going to connect anything else. Oh, I actually got it! The first and last time the fable took damage. That's fine. Him on top's got a little bit more of a supporty role anyway. So let's just take a swing at Toracat and see what happens. Um, so let's see, we've seen Disable. Not Disable. We've seen uh, Minimize. And we've seen it flinch. It's got Leftovers. It's probably got Follow Me. I wouldn't be shocked if it has, like, Moon Blast or Dazzling Gleam. It's a Ditto! 
You get all the attack drops! I almost, I almost brought uh, Defiant Thunderous specifically for this. Okay, so if the Fable's back to full health, yeah, the, the turn of flinch didn't really matter. Hitmontop is just doing Hitmontop things. We can aim a Moonblast at Ditto, but the Fake Out's probably coming at Musharna. So do we just swap Musharna out since both screens are up? We could do a double swap right now. I actually kind of like that idea. Yeah, this, this feels safe. I don't... There's not a whole lot going on on his side right now, and I'm really hoping that... Let's, let's see if I read where the fake out was going. Oh no! My screen! <laughs> I gave him the answer to my screen! <laughs> And he's holding a life orb. Clefairy's evasion is now maxed. So it's gonna take pretty much pure luck to hit that one now. We could just go for big damage. Man, that's unfortunate. I even knew he had Brick Brick. I knew he had Brick Brick. And I was like, nah, this is fine. This is safe. This is fine. Um... But, I do outspeed it, so maybe we can get flinchy flinch. Pulled out the ditto. For a Tora Cat, that is going to resist just about anything I could throw at it. But at least I decided to throw a, a ghost move into that slot. Or we could just aim it all at Clefable and watch it all whiff. One whiff. Two whiff. This is a rough one, to say the least. So Marowak's fine. He can't fake out Marowak. And you can't follow me against that either. So... Let's have Musharna come back in. And since he swapped Ditto out, let's, let's see if we can reset those screens. Sharna eats it. Oh, I hit them both! <laughs> the lower accuracy move. Of course it's going to hit the one with plus six evasion. Let's see, I'm, I'm feeling... I don't... Let's see, if he's gonna parting shot, I'm guessing he had parting shot at Marowak. I don't know what his Clefable is gonna do for damage, though, so let's just get a Reflect up for now, because Torracat's the one who's actually putting out. Let's see what Clefable's up to. Another follow me, that's fine. No swap out for you. So let's see. Heal pulse. We've seen two moves. We've seen two. Another rock slide for big damage. Now we can set the trigger. Now I feel a little safer doing this. Hmm. 
Is he gonna bring out Ditto so he can undo the Trick Room? No, Darmanitan! That's good news for me. Oh, Dazzling Gleam. Okay, so he got spread here too. So that... That screen will matter eventually. How much damage do you do? Big damage for rocks. Maybe I can pick it up. I should be able to KO it. Um, the hope is he's not going to follow me. I don't think he'll follow me. I'm guessing he's going to try and heal Pulse. Because uh, he knows I'm just mashing Rock Slide. And we're going to try and pick up Darmanitan just in case. Okay, no follow me. So yeah, this Darmanitan is going down for sure. We were able to connect another rock slide on Clefable. Oh, thank you, James. So kind of you. Om nom nom. That's gonna matter. Ooh, I, I need to bring Drampa next game. I know he's got Dazzling Gleam, but if Drampa can drop to half health, get a Berserk boost, and then, like, eat a heal pulse, that would be great. Okay, so that's two drops on Marowak. He's probably going to need to come out. Which is too bad, but let's go for another Rock Slide anyway. I don't think he's going to actually let the, the light screen through. But I'm going to put it up. Yeah, that's, that, that was what I meant by he's not going to let the light screen through. Clefable don't care. Tora Cat kind of care. All right. Marowak's gonna have to come out. But do I want to pull him this turn, or do I want to pull him next? I could just keep doing rock slides, because I'm, for the most part, winning these exchanges. Just aim that Clefable, see what happens. Yeah, I didn't think so. I mean, like, I'm hitting it with rock slides. Not this one, but, but previous rock slides. I'll take a flinch. GG. For nothing. You, you can't burn my fire type. I bet he was... Yeah, see, he was expecting the swap. Um, the reflect is gone. But the trick room is still up. This is the last turn. So we'll get the reflect up this turn. We'll be free to trick room again next turn if we need to. Kind of surprised he didn't... Well, it makes sense. I thought he would try and swap out Toracat and maybe, you know, kind of like set himself up to fake out Musharna when the time came, but... Is, is this how we're going to play this game, James? Just going to will-o-wisp my team and slow roll it until I die? Go for a single target. I gotta get Marowak out of here. His attack's being halved. It's not doing him any good. I gotta reset that. Maybe by swapping him out here, I can force Ditto in that spot. And that would be nice. Um, let's see. What are we looking at? We got just reflect up. So let's put up the light screen. That Tori Cat's still gonna end up being faster than pretty much anything I can put out because I can't put any training in any of my Pokemon next week. <laughs> Whew, 
for big damage. Yeah, no, your your Tora Cat does 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 nothing. This is gonna be a very long battle. But it's currently in my favor. Let's see, everything I got slower. So let's be faster. Is Torcat coming out? Torcat's probably coming out. I mean, fake out into that slot. I'm but I would really like to see him pull the fable. I don't think he's going to, but I would really like him. I really like to see it. If he's going for time, I'm currently got him there. Who's his fourth? Have I seen his fourth? I don't think I have. I think I saw just these two, and then he brought in Darman's hand. Maybe I did. This fight has lasted forever, and this is still just game one. I suspect a dazzling gleam. No, this is where I want to be. Check. Screen. We got reflect and light screen both up. That's cool. We can go for a little bit of damage. Let's see that DG. Whiff. Oh! Oh, you're so kind. Why, thank you. Oomph. Ah, he's fine. But he finally takes a hit, and I get my Malice run in safely! Woo! Do we want to bring in Mammal Swine? We could... Yes, of course we want to bring in Mammal Swine, because we got... we got tricks. Of course we want to bring in Mammal Swine. Alright, so we got an Earthquake there, and yeah, gosh, Rashar's really not doing anything right now. Maybe maybe setting up the Reflect would have been a really good idea right now. That's fine. I was going for a spread and aiming at you anyway. Oh, I connected with the Moon Blast! Can we get a crit? Nah, no crits. Rashar, don't care. Fable don't care because the Fable dodgy. Tori Cat very much care. I'll even let you flare blitz my Mammal Swine for your own KO. Oh, Mammal Swine don't care. That's that's also good news. Can I just pick off Tori Cat from here? I know I'm faster. I just might. Because I just om nom nom that flare blitz with no issue. That's not going to give you enough health. So that's two down. Slowly whittling him away. Who is the fourth? Did he show me? He did. I knew that. It was Ditto. He is Ditto and he is taking my Mushar. <laughs> Oh, three minutes left until the battle ends. That's good news for me. All right, 
There's like no way this Iron Head's actually connecting, but you know, ever so hopeful. Uh, we want the light screen. Because he is a very special team remaining. And this mammal swine is holding an assault vest, which is all the good news for me. Did he light screen because he knew I was going to light screen? Nom nom nom, thick pig. As, yeah, it's a nice one. <laughs> he has a way to answer my trick room now. Oh no! I guess this is the best we could do, just keep aiming at attacks of Clefable and hope we manage to make something connect. Oh, Mammal Swine hanging in there! Goodbye, Mammal Swine. Oh, I got him! <laughs> I knocked him once. And then we bring in the Marowak, and the Marowak can hit the Musharna very hard. I will be faster than it this time. Oh no, the battle ends soon! Eh, let's just double it. Let's see that can happen. James is going to force this one into time, huh? Okay, so it's it's just the Clefable as I was expecting this battle to come down to. But because I have three and he only has one, it's going to give me the game. So I appreciate your stall tactics, James, but I also came with stall tactics. Everything misses! Woo! <laughs> well, James had one remaining, and that was a very healthy Clefable remaining. <laughs> it says the battle's over, but I still picked my moves. Does it end here? Woo! Cool! We got game one! Stall tactics for the win! Yeah! <laughs> hey, I forfeit my second match. I'm too, I'm too tilted. Are, are you sure? Are you sure? Yeah.